Hello guys, today I'll be showing you how to get the iOS 10 and through iOS 7 um, signal bars on iOS 12. This works on any version of iOS 12. Uh, anyways, first you're going to want to get um, the file for it. So it's an assets.car file. Anyways, you can just search up how to get iOS 10 bars um, on iOS 11 and um, you can get it from 3U that's your seriously I'm gonna have to decline this really quickly um anyways what you want to going to want to do is get this file right here and you're going to want to get this but you have to download it of course why well, wouldn't you once you get it open it up with the 7-zip go ahead and on desktop extract it then Get, or well, you can do this on your phone too if you have Filza or any file manager. But next, you're gonna want to go to Files. Then you want to go and go to your root directory, System, Library. Now, if you were doing this on iOS 11, you could go ahead and follow that link. Or if you want a really quick um, explanation, go to Frameworks. Then it's and uikit.framework and then there will be a artwork you'll follow along from uikit.framework on iOS 12 you're going to want to go to private frameworks then if I can remember this correctly it took me a tiny bit to find I think it's down near it's UI something maybe which is not it uh, here it's uikitcore.framework then you'll go to artwork.bundle and here you see that I have something called 11assets.car you're going to want to go ahead and take the assets.car that's in there right now and rename that to anything or you can delete it but I'd recommend to rename it to say 11assets.car or something like that then copy over the iOS 10 assets from here to here, then rename it to assets.car. Then after that, you're going to want to go back into your root, or well, no, that's not root. You're going to want to go back into your root, then in var, mobile, then it was library, caches, or caches, then it will be in com.apple. UI status bar. You're going to want to either delete this or rename it. Either one works. Then you respring your device and after you do that then you could go ahead and go onto your device and well I was about to dox myself there. <laughs> You'll have um your iOS 10 or lower dots on iOS 12 or iOS 11. Thank you guys for watching. This was no script, that uh, fucking shitty ass video. But nobody else has made a video like this on iOS 12, as I believe. So, thank you.